everybody, I'm Jelani. And I'm Huggy Bear. And together we are Go Figure Reviews. And for today, we have... The Valverse Vanguard. Now, I've never, like, wanted this vehicle. <laughs> and I'll, I'm saying that up front. Because it's Valverse. It burned me with Sergeant Slaughter to begin with. Uh... I had to wait a long time to get a, get that, and I swore off Valverse. I did purchase a few things here and there. I'm getting this out of the way to say this. This is not bad. It's not. like I like most Valverse stuff, don't get me wrong. You know, this is great as is, for the most part. There's mm. issues, though, that okay. I, I have with it. So you have issues with it. Now, you got this uh, how long ago? Uh, about two months ago or so. So it's been about two months, and you played around with it. Of course, you customized it yourself. Yeah. This this has all of the what the his tank stickers. Yes, pretty much. Uh, it looks great. Yeah, look. I like the way the vehicle looks anyway. But tell me, like, like, well, what are your as a car? The thing's solid. When you start adding like the turrets and stuff, mm -hmm. it loses it to me. Because like, all right, so we have turrets. Yeah, we shall take. The top one. Sure, if you plug it in, it spins around. The machine guns even do the same. But, big issue is... It doesn't go up and down. Yeah. It doesn't elevate. As much as Bobby tries dunking like, on anything Hasbro does, he fucks that up. Yeah, and it really ruins the, the integrity of the figure because... Or the, the vehicle because you can't do the cool stuff. I mean, I want to take dumb pictures with my toys doing just whatever. And I, unless I get it modified, I modify it myself, I lose the ability to do that with that out of the box. Right. That should be one of those box standard things. I'm sorry what anybody else thinks. It should be. Right. And I get it. And it's not a bad looking vehicle. No, it looks I great. Mean, like I said, it's got its moments. It's, it's, it's a very solid piece. Like, you can open the doors... It's not. All four doors open. All four doors open. <laughs> the trunk opens. The trunk opens. It's it's. But uh, the hood doesn't open. Yeah, the freaking hood doesn't touch. You can't do anything with it. So I mean, it's it is what it is. For, and as large as it is, I'm surprised because of course comparing it to like Bruce here, he your he, average he, three year old uh, three month old cat. Yeah, come he here, dude. Comes in, ah, but. Right. Comparing it with this vehicle, it's much larger. Well, the vamp, the vamp is is a small compared to it, but at the same time, you can still like even though this pops off, it can still elevate. It goes up and down, and you want and it was half the price. Something that yeah, and you didn't have to wait like twenty years to get it. Right. Yeah, it appeared and it came in and out. It does what it does. And then, like, you get the Stinger, too. Stinger is basically the same thing. Oh, definitely. Just a few different odds and ends. Yeah, it's 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 about the same. And it has its own turret of missiles and things like that. Yeah. But and these, ooh, look, up, down. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. So, it's, the, I mean, it, all in all, it's, it's, it's fine. I mean, we have these things to show you because... It's much larger vehicle. Yeah, it is like, it's and it's cool for what it is. Yeah, I mean, I can't really complain about just oh, drop that. You take that part on solid armored car. You got an armored car. Yeah, I mean, Not too bad. zero complaints like that. Not till you add the turrets, or even the missile turret, which has the same problem as the machine guns. Right, and Bruce is inspecting it as well. Or about to. Yeah, it's all good, but. I mean, this this thing is like, it, it's not bad for what it is. You get even a figure with it. So, like, you have, what is this guy's name? Do you have a name? A generic driver, I think. Generic driver. He's okay. His face is all right. Um, this is apparently the new buck. Yeah. For this. That's what I've been told. Yeah, and he's not bad I mean, for that. I've got no problems with it. You know, it's got... I don't yeah. like the smaller-ish heads on a Valverse figure, yeah. but I like the head sculpt, so it's kind of taking or what you get out of it. Right. And then you get, you get missile stuff. I mean, it well, does have the uh, missile, turret. missile turret, but it has its own missiles. You can, you can 
pop that pump piece off. I'm again. waiting for correct colors to come sometime whenever that happens, so but, don't at me. Yeah, but you can't elevate this either. Yeah, it's... It why is not? It is. I mean, you, you take the missiles out, you put them in. It's decent. I like that. It's it's simple. It works. It's yeah. better than the stingers. Yeah. Definitely. The reused the bazooka effects. Yeah. Absolutely terrible for that, but this looks good. Yeah, it looks good. It's like almost there, just a little bit more engineering. Yeah. We we could have done a little more, guys. We got skimped out on that. Yep. And it, the other thing that I have kind of an issue with with this is it, it kind of looks like something I buy at Walmart. Like, it, it has the price of something. Or, I mean, not the price. Not the but price. Not the price. It has the look. Like, it, it looks like a generic, like, toy that you would get Definitely. at Walmart. Well, you get a sticker sheet with it. Yeah. That. But it, it's still kind of plain to me. Uh, I'm sure the tan version looks even more so like this. I like this gray version. Oh, yeah. I, I like, I'm not complaining about that part, but it still has that feel like, I don't know. Once again, going back to the vamp. Well, you get the vamp, it look like the plastic looks good. It looks cleaner to me. And of course, Bruce would be, would know too, but it looks different with that going forward. As opposed to this, like, I don't know what it is where I, I see this and then I look at this and it's not really, they don't yeah. really like. Yeah, the quality of the in. plastic, I yeah. get you. It's just not, I don't know how to explain it, but it's just those little things. It's minor gripes yeah. for that. But those minor yeah. gripes keep adding up. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you can, it holds four figures inside, one in the turret, one in the back if you put the machine gun there. Then it's got like. Four foot pegs, so you can have four guys on the outside. You can just throw dudes all around it, which is cool, but I don't know. It's just feeling lacking on those little few yeah. things. It's, it's, it is what it is, though. I mean, so honestly, like, if we're gonna, if we would rate it, what would you rate this? Like, out of, out of the zero to five figure points that we give, what would you rate it? I'd give it about a three and a half. So it's a three and a half for you. I'm not so dissatisfied I'd persuade somebody not to buy it, mm -hmm. but I'm not so gun ho for it that I'd really encourage them to go do it. Gotcha. If you're like, if you really like Valvers, definitely add it to your collection. Mm -hmm. If you're a fence sitter, I honestly would kind of skip it. Okay. So, yeah. I would probably give it a three uh, for that same reason. It's 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 average. Yeah. It's it's very average. Um, I'm, I not, had... like, I'm not wowed by it. I had a higher hope for something beyond yeah. average. I wanted, oh, you're going to outdo the stinger and the vamp. Yay! Yeah. You know, because usually when Bobby says he's going to do something, he's pretty good at doing it. Right. You know. But, like, I don't know. Yeah, it's it's little things, though. And this, by the way, kind of looks cheap. Oh, oh, look. It does elevate. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's just super tight. It's very tight. Well, I feel like an idiot now. That's all good. Well, you know how many times I've tried moving that thing? Really? Yeah. Well, I just did it. Womp womp. Well. That's not bad. Eh, see, that makes it look better. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's... I'll give it a four now. Well, see, that's... <laughs> hey, here's kidding. the thing. Here's the thing. That's a separate piece this, to buy. You have to buy this. Yeah. Separately. Wow. Yeah. So yeah, the, never mind. I'm back to three. It, it It's okay. Yeah, like, you buy this. MSRP 200. On. MSRP 30. Why are we not, like adding this this should just be like with this vehicle well if you bought it on pre-order you would have got them together oh that's what it is well i mean hey those are the brakes yeah it is what it is man uh i've had and, this thing for months and i haven't done that yeah and we finally got a chance to like review it so that's cool yeah. that's all good man so guys tell us what you think in the comments uh how many figure points would you give it uh tell us what if you have if you had this, do you have any issues with it? Um, this is just a simple rant video. We wanted to try a little different format, get everything together. Um, you got any final thoughts? Anything you want to say? No, not really. It's a thing. It's a thing that happened. Yeah. All right. So be it. And of course, uh, we're going to. We had 500 subscribers. Uh, we're doing a ferret video. Cool. Uh, 
that you must oh. do. So basically, uh, we had 500 subscribers uh, that were added to our channel. We're super excited. Thank you so much. Each and every one of you. Yeah, you're awesome. And of course, Nate is giving away this ferret. And we are very close to announcing a winner. Uh, in fact, I'll probably announce it today or tomorrow or sometime. Bruce will tell us. Uh, but hopefully you put in Ferret 500 on our video and oh, you are a subscriber of Ferret it. 500. That's right. Hashtag Ferret 500. I'll put it in the link. Um, but guys, keep liking, sharing, subscribing, telling your friends about us. Uh, Huggy's Toy Shop, he's getting ready. Um, thank you so much, Nate, for showing us this lovely, lovely Vanguard um, and your gripes with it. And, uh, you know, not everything's gonna be solid. I don't, you know, I don't want to like blow smoke up everybody's ass about. Oh, look how great everything is when it's not. You know, right. I can get tell the truth, man. We review. More, yeah, more so objective reviews. That's right. I know I've got my biases. Who doesn't? Right. Exactly. And of course, like I said, tell us what you think in the comments. And of course, get out there and go, go figure. figure.